Well, thanks for joining me today. What we're going to do, we've hunted and chased down a woolly bear caterpillar. Woolly worm is what I always called him when I was a little girl. It looks like it has a real long segment of orange in the middle. Now, what I was always told by my parents, my grandma, my grandpa on both sides, that the orange represents the mild part of the winter. And in this case, we've got a sh at the head is a longer black segment. At the end on the top here is the shorter black segment. So it looks like we're going to begin with a hard winter and end with a hard winter. But we've got a long period of mild winter in there. He's This uh, worm is heading west at this direction. And once he pops up onto the sidewalk, he's heading, what would that be? That would be north. So we are making some predictions. I'm kind of sticking my neck out. You know, this is a kind of, um, you believe it or you don't believe it. And really, those bands are based on how he ate this past year. <clears throat> but... If you can see him through the shadows, we thought we were going to lose him a couple times in the cracks of the sidewalk, but we managed to get him or her to come back out. And I hope what he does is try to winterize under some of my hypertufa pots. I understand they just kind of hibernate and um, exude some kind of antifreeze into their own little bodies and just spend the winter all frozen they thaw in the spring just like everything else does but based on his 13 segments it looks to me like he has six in the front i'm sorry five in the front that are black six in the middle that are orange and two on the end that are black so i'm going to stick my neck out with my predictions on his head with those five segments december 22nd to january 26th Snow's going to be deep and very, very cold. Now his middle six segments are orange. So January 26th to March 7th, it's going to be milder. Not a bad winter. But at the end, two segments, they're black. So we're going to get hammered at the end. Let's wait and see. 